imagine standing in a room with a group of 20 Jewish students in, you know, it's in Europe, um, and, uh, and an angry mob banging on the doors, banging on the windows, circling the room. There was two exits from the room. Both of them were, um, uh, you know, you hear the banging, you hear the chanting, uh, where is Chen, where is Chen, Intifada, Intifada. Um, I've been through the Intifada, I was almost killed in the Intifada. Uh, and to hear those screams and those chants and um, from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. You know exactly what they're, t they're talking about. Did you so feel afraid for your, for your personal security and the security of the other people in the room? Yeah, I was. You know, I, um, I, I, I wasn't fear, fearing for my life. It's not like I was, uh, my life was not in, in risk, but I did, uh, I was afraid for the, uh, for the safety of the students and myself. And, and I knew that if someone will, uh, will attack me and I will retaliate it, uh, you know, the media coverage will be terrible and it will be just against, against us, um, saying that we were the one responding. That's what they're trying to do. Um, several anti-Israel uh, media publications are, are saying that we were the one that attacked them, uh, which is ridiculous because three Jewish students were attacked um, and we were the one in, in a room circled by them. So once again, they're trying to become the victims, but yeah, it was, uh, it was scary.